good morning it is thursday the 2nd of december I had to think there um i'm doing another vlog for vlogmas i'm gonna start off with opening my advent calendars it is literally half 10 like i cannot remember the last time <coughs> i'm losing my voice that i slept until this time but i woke up um earlier on and had such a bad sore throat and then obviously went back to sleep so i must have needed it feeling a little bit ill so i'm gonna try and get some tablets into me asap because i do not want to feel ill for the whole day um so yeah just give miley her breakfast i'm gonna open my advent calendars i think i'm gonna let james give the cats their advent calendars today um and just see what we get up to i don't really have anything planned i've got a delivery coming of the cat food that i was waiting for yesterday um but other than that just gonna see what happens james is on a late day so he starts at like two half two um so he's gonna help me finish um moving around and cleaning the spare room after the spider incident yesterday because i don't want to do that alone Okay, let's have a little look for number two. Where is it? Oh, it's a little cute box today. Let's see if I can open it with one hand. If I can. Ooh, this looks interesting. So this is the Lumen Nordic... No, I can't speak... Nordic Hydra Oxygen Recovery Hydrogel Mask. That looks interesting. So I feel like it's like a little face mask. Yeah, it's a little face mask, which is hydrating. So I can't wait to try that. And I'm going to give that a go today and I will tell you how to get on. So I'm just going to pop that back in. I've got a little Instagram thing to <laughs> um, film. Like I'm doing like little reels and TikToks. And then I'm going to open my Cadbury's one. <coughs> what are you doing? You've already had it. You've already had it now. Do you wait till tomorrow? So I'm just about to go in the shower, so I thought I would just quickly show you what products I'm using. Um, which to be honest have been pretty much the same for a while now i've got the quiet detox shampoo which i've only got a little bit left so i'm trying to use up the same with my moringa body shop conditioner and um, i really really love using these because they make my hair really nice and shiny and like soft um but i'm excited to finish them so i can use some new products i've also got a hair mask which i just took out of my um like beauty cupboard um a few days ago and um, because i ran out of my other mask i've got the boots oat body wash and um, which i use because i've obviously got like a really bad eczema breakout at the minute so that just really helps to calm my skin and then i do still exfoliate um like my legs and arms with the glam wax apple pie whipped body scrub which is honestly amazing i wish you could smell it through the screen it is so good and um, it was one of their like autumn products and i absolutely love it so i'm gonna use that and then i've also made myself a coffee in my rubby mummy mug which says living my best festive life which i definitely am so yeah i'm gonna have my coffee have a shower i'll do my skincare later because i do want to test out that um skincare product as well that i got from the advent calendar um so i'll do that later but yeah just gonna go in the shower and wash my hair so I've just got out of the shower, um, ignore my very creased t-shirt, but it is actually quite warm and sunny today. Like I was literally in a jumper freezing yesterday. Um, and because I'm gonna be cleaning today, I don't wanna get too warm. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm gonna dry my hair, go downstairs and make James and me dinner. Because he's on a late, he usually has like a bigger meal. So like, in my opinion, that's tea um, for dinner. So we've got some leftover minced beef from yesterday when I made a chili. Um, so I'm going to make spaghetti bolognese, I think, um, and I'll just have like a small portion. Um, and then I'll probably just have like my dinner for tea. So like a sandwich or something, if that makes sense. So yeah, going to cook us some food, probably just sit down and watch Goggle Box, not going to lie. Um, we've changed around the spare room. Um, so we've done a bit in there um, and then James has done some washing up and stuff. So as soon as he goes 
to work. I will probably get cracking with the rest of the jobs to do, but I still haven't watched the rest of my Christmas film that I was watching yesterday, so I still want to finish that. So ignore the very frizzy hair, I definitely need to straighten it. I just got an email saying that the dress that I ordered last night, which was going to be the dress that I would wear for the Christmas party, has gone out of stock after I've ordered it. So I've been having a look, hunting on Google um, and loads of websites to see if I can find anything and I can't. So I'm probably just going to have to go to town um, tomorrow and see if there's anything or wear something I've already got. So that's annoying. Um, but yeah, James has gone to work. We've had dinner. We watched Gogglebox literally for like two hours, I think. Um, so I'm now going to try and get cracking on the house because I'm not going to lie, it's a mess. I'm not going to show you because it's a little bit embarrassing how messy it's got. But it's fine. I'm just hoping if I can get it all done or a good chunk of it. I say this like every week. But while I'm off and then... Um, I've made a schedule that I can stick to like weekly so like cleaning a room every single day um, because like obviously if there's the kitchen, living room, bedrooms, office, bathrooms like individually and then the hall and landing um, I can split it into seven so then the days that I'm working and um, when I come home if I do like smaller ones so like the downstairs toilet or just the hall and landing on my office then hopefully i'll be able to stick to it because if i'm honest like i've struggled just keeping on top of the house like when we first moved in i literally like kept it so clean i really enjoyed cleaning and doing all the housework um and i think the novelty of that wore off and now i've just found it so hard to like keep on top of it because you know it'd be like really clean and then the three days that I'm at work because I'm like out at work all day I come home and like washing up gets left and things just get messy so fingers crossed I'm gonna be able to um stick to that but like I said I want to get the house ready um and clean and organize over the next few days so that I can start that schedule if that makes sense and now I'm just rambling um yes yeah, so I'm gonna start cleaning the house got some packages coming so I'm gonna listen out for those just clean up and then I might also straighten my hair because Look how frizzy it is. So I've just got a delivery, so I thought we could open it up together. It is from my friend Christy, and um, we haven't seen each other in ages, so she sent me a little gift. Um, so I've come up in the office where um, the lighting is quite nice. I'm just <laughs> hiding my address, don't mind me. Um, yes, yeah, so I thought we could open it up together. So I can see that it's from Moonpig. I've opened, like, cut this little slit here, but I haven't opened it yet. So let's see what's inside. Oh, it's a little penguin. Let me see if I can keep that box open. Oh, get it out. Um, let me see. It's a little warmy that you can put in the microwave. So it's like a hot water bottle that you put in the microwave. This is actually such a good idea because the hot water bottles I have are the ones that you have to put the water in. So this is very practical. And how cute is he? I'll have to give him a name. Mm, I think Pete, Pete the penguin. Oh, he's really soft and cuddly and there's a little card in there as well. So I'm just going to pop him there. Let's see. And get it out with one hand. Oh, it's a little Christmas card with us on it. Oh, that feels like forever ago, that photo. And it's actually at one of our favourite restaurants to eat. And we are planning on booking um, to go there, I think, soon. Merry Christmas to my best friend. Oldest and smallest friend. Oh, thank you, Chrissy and Ebony, for my little gift. I'm going to pop my card up. And I absolutely love Peter the Penguin. Now, interestingly enough, as I... um got the delivery as there was a knock on the door I was actually in the middle of changing my um, duvet cover to my new Christmassy duvet cover so he will fit in very very well with my little winter aesthetic in the bedroom um, so once the bedding is changed I'm going to pop him on there so yeah thanks guys
So the Christmas duvet is on. It's a little bit creased, but I didn't really see the point in ironing it. So I'm hoping it just like kind of undoes itself a little bit. Um, I've put a little penguin pee on the bed. Um, this red and pink cushion is from IKEA and I got it ages ago for the office, but then I changed the colour scheme. So it's just kind of like floating around, but because there is red and pink on the duvet set, I thought it fit in quite well. I've put my little... Um, eye mask on there i don't wear this as much anymore because um it was more so for when i was doing night shifts and like trying to sleep in the day but it's just good to have at least and obviously the color matches my wall um i've still got my fan out because literally a few nights ago it was so warm um i don't even think we had the heating on but like the weather's just been on and off at the moment so i thought i'm gonna keep it out i'm just gonna leave it for now um i do need to get some like bedside um lamps as well but yeah for now it'll just stay so that's my little um transformation it's got like um gray uh, material with snowflakes on the other side and um, the same with like the pillowcases it definitely wasn't the kind of style i was going to go for but i do actually quite like it and as i said i think these colors go really well together and um, there's still a lot of stuff to do in the house but i'm pleased that i've at least got this done um, and now I'm not going to let the cats come in the room anymore because Ruby's been in and out of heat. So she's been spraying everywhere. Miley quite likes to curl up in a ball and sleep on the bed. And there's just been cat hair everywhere. So I have always been like a person that has just not really cared about where pets go. But now I'm becoming a strict parent and I'm like, they are not allowed in the bedroom anymore. <laughs> so at least I know this will stay nice and clean. started quickly show you in here Miley is exploring and um, so we've moved the bed over here there's lots of stuff here to sort out and then I've also got the Christmas duvet that's going to go on so once we've moved those I'm going to pop that on Um, this unit here we're going to get some more of those cube boxes to fill it out and to ignore the bits that are around it obviously as I said I did get Ruby a new litter tray so that's all nice and secure and clean and doesn't smell uh she's got a little bed there um and yeah so this is uh, this room for now until i've sorted the bed out miley come in are you coming downstairs for your tea come on come on this isn't your room is it ruby is literally under the bed right now so this is probably not the ideal position for Miley to be in right now. <laughs> so I've actually been cleaning the bedroom. Quite proud of how much I've done, not going to lie. Still quite a lot to do though. Um, I've come downstairs because I've got the washing load to take out and put on the era. Another load to put in. I'm also going to grab my uh, little mask that I got in my advent calendar because I'm going to do my skincare and get ready now. Um, I don't know if I mentioned earlier that the dress that I was going to buy for the Christmas party went out of stock. So... Um, it's late night shopping tonight in town, so my mum mentioned going to town tonight. Um, so I thought that makes sense, because to be honest, I'm getting my nails done tomorrow anyway. So hopefully I'll go to town and find something. And then I've got the bedroom to finish. The kitchen's looking a little bit messy from when I made dinner. Um, so I'll tidy that up, but at least I'm just having like an easy tea. Like I said, I'm just going to have like lunch slash dinner for my tea, just like a sandwich or something. Um, so that's a plan. Um, I feel like these vlogs are just going to be very much the same, just me doing random stuff, not very interesting. So I'm going to sit down and I'm going to hopefully try and plan a few 
more interesting things to include over the vlogs. I definitely want to sit down and do my little pottery craft set that I got last Christmas that I still haven't done. So that might be quite fun. Um, or maybe even thinking of just going to some like different places that have some nice Christmas things like a Christmasy garden centre. Um, I did want to go away with James to a Christmas market this year, but I just don't think we're going to have the time and money for it. Like, I'll have a look, but I don't think so. So just anything that I can do um, that's festive, that's, you know, fun and exciting for the month, because as I said, I do want to make the most of December. So yeah, as I said, I'm going to sit down and plan some things and I'm going to watch some Christmas films, because as I said in my last vlog, I want to watch a Christmas film every time that I'm off throughout December. So we'll see what I choose. I was just about to pop on my mask, but then I thought... Do I want to pop it on now when I'm going to be putting makeup on? Even though it still have the effect. So I think what I might do is wait till uh, later on, um, after I finish cleaning, have a little self-care evening like with a cup of tea, put my mask on, maybe when I'm watching my Christmas film. So I'm going to leave that um, and I'm just going to do my usual skincare and a little bit of natural makeup as well. Um, I'm just using the cleanser that I got yesterday. Uh, so I won't really show you too much because I might be doing a like winter skincare routine video uh, for my channel as like a main video for one of the days that I'm at work for vlogmas. So yeah, I won't show you too much. I'm just going to get ready and I'll catch up with you in a bit. So I've just got back from shopping, had a little look around town, um, got a couple of things for my friend Christy for Christmas. So I've took them out the bag so that she can't see if she watches. Um, so I went into New Look, guess what I found? Well, my mum found, should I say? The green dress that I actually ordered originally that was out of stock. So um, it's obviously like got green sequins on it. It's a bit of like a smock style with a belt around it um and it does actually go really high up on the neck which is definitely what i wanted because my eczema is quite bad at the minute and um, like on my chest so i didn't want that on show um but yeah it's also not like itchy because of the material on the inside and i got it for 20 pound and 39 pence so to be honest i saved money by it actually being cancelled and me going to town but um it was quite stressful so i did try on a couple of other dresses which you may have seen and because obviously I saved some money, um, I did want some more gold jewellery um, to wear with it because I'm going to be wearing it with some black boots. I have gold heels and maybe taking a gold bag. Um, so I've got these. I think everything's tangled. Let me see. There we go. Um, just picked these. So these are some like little earrings and I think I'll probably wear the ones with stars on. I do have some like proper gold ones that are quite similar to these, but um obviously they're just really nice and shiny and they were 4.99 i then got a necklace um assuming i can wear it with the style of the dress which i think i should be able to um i just might need to make it quite long and i really like that kind of like hammered effect miley no seriously like this is what she does every time we'd have to move things before she ruins it get off <laughs> Um, I also got this ring, which I thought was really pretty. Um, just obviously gold again. Uh, $1.99. I thought I would wear that like on my middle finger, so I got it in a large. It'd be quite nice on the thumb as well, though, to be honest. Um, and then last but not least, I think, yeah, um, I got another ring. So I probably will wear this, like, obviously when I go out as well. But I used to want something that looked exactly like this in silver when I worked at H. Samuels years ago. So I thought I'd just treat myself. It's a little, like, knot, which I think is really cute. Two ninety nine. So, yeah, that's everything I got. Some gold jewellery, um, which, like I said, I will wear when I go out. Because I'm wearing heels with a gold heel. What am I about? 
boots with a cool teal and then the dress. <sighs> I'm out of breath now. So yeah, very productive shopping trip. Um, I'm now going to make tea. I've just put some jacket potatoes in the microwave. I'm going to pop them in the oven now. Um, I'm just going to have them with tuna, I think, and maybe like some snacks because obviously I had spaghetti bolognese for dinner, so I don't want anything too big. Um, while they are in the oven, I'm going to have a little tidy around upstairs and like in the bedroom and then the kitchen um, because obviously, as I said earlier, I was tied in the bedroom, so there's like a few things on the floor that I need to sort out. Um, and then I'm probably just going to sit down and watch a Christmas film. Is this cat for real? <laughs> Luckily, it's not a material that she can click with her nails. What are you doing? You gonna get off mummy's bag? Hmm? You gonna get off mummy's bag and mummy's dress that you're sitting on and getting your fur all over? so i finished cleaning and tidying the bedroom i'm honestly sweating because i've just obviously done that much um and this is honestly the cleanest and tidiest the bedroom has been in months which is kind of embarrassing to admit but i just haven't had the time to like do everything at once if that makes sense so I've had a really good organise in the bedroom and clean and tidy got my little trinkets on the drawers obviously like my creams and deodorant that needs to go on the bathroom um as I said I changed my bedding we've got <laughs> two other teddies they've somehow joined the gang and um, my little cushion thing which is really useful when I'm sitting in my bed like on my laptop or something because it obviously it helps me sit up straight so i've just put that there but obviously that goes on the floor when we go to sleep um i do still need to hoover the rug i've got my little dressing table all clean it's a bit marked but i suppose that's just because it's white and it's a dressing table my desk's exactly the same but i've got glass on my desk um so yeah i need to put some little pictures on that and put that somewhere but that's what I've been doing. So it's probably going to be quite a short vlog. But I honestly have just took so long doing this today. So I'm just about to go to bed, but firstly I've just taken off my makeup and I'm going to pop on this little mask and then I'll probably just chill in bed for a little bit and wash it off just before I go to sleep. You might be able to hear Ruby in the background, she is wowling. Um, so yeah, just going to give this a little test, if I can open it that is. There we go. Oh, I don't know if you're going to be able to see the texture of that, but it is very much like a gel but it looks like really bouncy I think that would probably be the best word you just use a little bit apply or oh, apply a generous layer on clean skin leave on for 15 minutes and wipe off perfect maybe a little bit more I feel like this would actually last quite a while because obviously the pot isn't that big but Quite like a thick gel. So yeah, that feels like really, really nice and soft. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna leave that on for a little bit and take it off. I really like the packaging of these products as well. Like I think, do 
very simple but very nice so that's the two products i've got so far i've already lost the different oh there it is <laughs> um yeah so as i said i'm just gonna maybe lie down and scroll on my phone or something before bed ideally i should like read a book or listen to a podcast or that kind of thing but keep it real <laughs> i'm probably just gonna scroll like tiktok videos or something and then we take off and go to bed <laughs> 